This is a short presentation on how to use the Atlas Batch Tasks functionality to upload customer information, new customers, um, across companies. So this is a similar presentation to one you may have seen earlier where we've got some uh, party IDs, we've got some customer name information, and uh, the thing that makes this example different is that we've added a column called Company so we're going to be uploading information to company CEU as well as to company CEC. So a little bit of quick review. We'll take a look and see that we've got some name ranges already set up and mapped to various columns. We've got the company mapped to a name range called data area ID. Okay. We've also got some templates inserted into this document. We've got an append address book and append customers. We also have a batch that was built called simple customer append. It consists of an action message, the upload of the address book template followed by the customers template, and then an insert count action which will show us the number of records that were updated. So to take this one step further beyond what you learned earlier, to make the multi-company batch uh, operate correctly, we need to do a, take a couple setup steps. So we'll start by making sure we're in designer mode, and we are. We will click on the table append function. Click the customer's template go to the append tab right click the company accounts field and choose equal data area ID as the name range that will map us to the corresponding column called data area ID which contains two different companies worth of information All right. we want to always make sure we click insert which is going to insert this change into the document then the next thing we want to do is go into the batch itself. So we'll click the batch tasks icon. We'll take a look at our simple customer append batch. What we're going to do is click on the job selection tab. We're going to click the address book template. Go to properties and click split parameters by data area ID. Click apply, click close, go down to the customer's template, click properties, also split parameters by data area ID. Click apply, click close. Okay, so that is pretty much going to do it for us. Let's let's continue here. We definitely don't need want to forget to click insert to insert the revised batch into this document. At this point in time we should be able to execute the upload through the batch. So if you recall we change to standard mode. We click start batch and we click run. The batch immediately stops because we told it to first step here is displaying us a message saying are you ready to continue yes we are click OK so if you'll notice Atlas is looking at each of the templates and it's splitting the upload across company CEU and CEC for both the address book information as well as the customer information okay so it's that easy We've successfully uploaded the address information to two companies. That concludes this short presentation.